Hey, welcome to the channel. If you wonder, I'm Fani Maradani, talking about all sorts of stuff at this channel. Today, uh, I would like to talk about a movie which I recently catched in a theater uh, from one of my favorite directors from Tamil. Yes, Mari Silvaraj. So, a movie called Ma Manan was released very recently from Mari Silvaraj and then I happened to see that movie uh, because I really liked his earlier two films. He has made two uh, feature films till now, uh, Piriyar Parumal and Karnan. Especially Karnan is one of my all-time favorite uh, in Tamil cinema played by Danush. So, uh, both of these films are uh, a kind of a really powerful and then, you know, they're very angry movies. Movies uh, that has to be heard, right? And uh, movies that actually drastically talking about um, issues of the caste, uh, oppression and uh, discrimination. So, Mari Selvaraj uh, movies um, is a filmmaker. He is actually with a lot of social voice. is a great social voice. His movies always talks about social issues in very intense manner. Right. So, uh, and also it, Mari Selvaraj makes his movies very stylish and then, you know, um, they are very intense, as I said before. So, so the Mari Selvaraj movies is really grabs you. And for me, they also felt very intense because the emotions are well directed and, um, and they're very focused. So, and at the end of the each, both the movies, yeah, this is earlier two movies, um, you know, you feel really emotionally uh, charged. So do watch, if you haven't watched these two films by Mari Selvaraj, they are available in OTT. So with that expectations in mind, I was eagerly waiting for his written and directed third venture which is Mamanan. Let's go into the movie how I felt about it. Mamanan literally translates to the great emperor which is also the name of the uh, uh, the hero uh, played by Vadivel um, and also um, yeah and, and, and he's an MLA basically from an oppressed caste and also his son Udayanidhi Stalin uh, is also the second hero or protagonist right and then of course then we have Fat Fazl played as an antagonist or the villain he's also a politician from an upper caste so named by Ratnavel so these are the characters and then I know um, so this is a story about a political drama and trauma basically so Mamanan is an angry and extreme film that really tries very hard to be intense unfortunately though this time i really did not get connected with the movie this is because um, the movie characterization uh, kind of felt very flat uh, and the grounding of the characters and then the emotions are not well taken care so this is my major complaint with uh, Mama Nan. It uh, doesn't really work for me this time, you know, um, because the intensity was there, the imagery and then kind of symbols all is there as part of uh, typical Mari Selvan's uh, movies. That's expected. But somehow the political drama looks too superficial and shallow. And uh, as I said, the grounding of the characters uh, could have been better. And then uh, I felt I'm not invested much into the story and characters uh, as I should be. The, the, the whole movie, um, uh, though it's intense on the surface level, but the connect because of this obvious political drama, um, it, it appeared to be an agenda driven or a kind of a preachy at sometimes flat in terms of a screenplay. So these are all my major complaints with uh, Mom and then compared to, uh, of course, Mari's high standard of uh, standard set by his earlier flicks. And also a big letdown for me is um, Udayanidhi Stalin. So his uh, characterization, this characterization requires a powerful actor. Um, unfortunately, uh, he didn't deliver to me. So I'm not really uh, convinced that he is the act for this role. So that's another uh, downside of the movie. And A. Rahman uh, is, of course, has given undeniably very powerful background music. And the scores are very nice. And uh, uh, especially the song... Uh, Jiljul uh, Raile or something that number was crazy so but at the same time he tried to bring the intensity which Mari Selvan kind of visualized or imagined into the movie it was there but as I said the character work and then storytelling lacks the depth which I anticipated so these are all my major complaints of uh, Ma Manan.
but having said that it's worthwhile to watch this movie uh, just because i you know we are comparing with his earlier great works and it, it kind of it will pale away in that direction but uh, but yeah so it's certainly a good social uh, uh, social statement and if you like his work uh, obviously and uh, there is a lot of imaginary and a lot of symbolism he is used uh, if you have seen his earlier movies he uses a lot of animals as a big metaphors uh, to tell his story uh, you know to to visualize um to visually you know kind of present his his ideas so i like previous movies as i said that the blue dog in the first movie and then kind of donkey uh, tied with tied with two, two legs tied uh, donkey and then horse uh, now in this movie he has used a lot of dogs and then also piglets so there is a lot of uh, meta animal metaphors and kind of imaginary so that he is used to create that intensity and uh, of course the background score and then mehran rahman music and then camera work all looks intense so there are all the positive sides of this movie but as i said <coughs> if you compare with his karnan which is an all time great uh, movie and also all time my favorite of a tamil movie uh, no with that high expectations maybe you'll get little disappointed so i'll go with 3 out of 5 for this movie um, it's worthwhile to give a shot in a theater um, of course it is played with subtitles in tamil uh, i guess i think there will be a telugu release coming soon uh, with the name called noi kudu uh, maybe in a week or so So that's all for now and uh, I hope you like this uh, short review of Mamanan if you haven't seen it if you see if you saw already this movie uh, what do you think about this movie please do comment in the comment box or comment section right and uh, do connect or hit me in Instagram with funny maradani I'm also on Twitter with funny maradani I hope you like this talk and if you like it please give me a thumbs up and also please subscribe and share for now bye